What I do here? I'm... Leave it. Demo. <laughs> what I do here? Are you also stopping? <laughs> huh? Speak up. What I do to him? <laughs> Speak. <laughs> what I do? I don't, I don't want them. Huh? I don't want them to help him. You don't want who? People to help him. How do you block people? I scatter everything. I scatter the church. Okay, yes. Tell people to go. From you scatter what? Everybody who comes close. Before you need deliverance, I'm telling you. You really need So everybody who come close, you scatter them. Yes. Who knows the brother? Who knows him? Huh? We come with him. It's from Botswana. You nearly not to know him. You were very close to say I don't know him. You say what are you doing? You scatter everyone. Uh, around him. Around him. Yes. And that's how you make ministry small. Yes. Huh? Yes. So you know him? I don't know him. We meet him at the church there. You meet here? A at the church there, at Botswana. You're you right. Mm -hmm. In Jesus' name. You leave my brother in Jesus' name. He's free, this man. Where is that one? There's another one I was praying for here. Uh, where is the lady? Rise up. Where is the lady that I was praying for? That lady, she's not delivered. Brother, what is happening to your ministry? Ah, people are leaving. People are leaving? Yes. Can you see, when you start to see people leaving, don't look at the people who are leaving. Look at the one who called you. You understand? Because he might be telling you something. You find that you don't need them. You hear me? Yes. No, stand in one place. <laughs> don't, don't do what you're doing. Look here. If people are leaving you when you have a church, don't look at them when they are leaving. Yourself, you know your calling, isn't it? Yes. Eh? yes. You concentrate in your calling. You concentrate in your calling. You must never beg anyone to stand with you. Amen. Because if God sent people to you, he also sent provision. Amen. But if you try to maintain people by yourself, you make provision by yourself. That's how you find many pastors are suffering now. Because you are crying for people. Oh God, bring people, bring people. No, the Bible says, when your heart is one, you will add. You just say, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You thank God for his work. You carry on. This is the dangerous prayer I don't pray. I don't pray for God to bring people in my church. Because the more they come, they come with their problems. I just stay connected with Jesus so that if they come, God will use me to solve the problem of the people who are coming. You need 20 people, you have got 20 problems. You have got 30 people, you have got 30 problems. You understand? And sometimes you can't even see the demons that are in them. So the best way you maintain the relationship with Jesus, you don't look at the number that is coming. If you look at the number, you will look at the offering. If you look at the offering now, you lose anointing. You lose direction now. You try to do crusade, you do this you, to make people to come now. And you find that God is no longer with you. You are doing it with yourself. That's the reason why you see many, many crusades. You see many, many crusades. Because the issue is you look at the, the number. After you look at the number, you have to look at the offering. When now the offering is small now, you go out for crusade to add the offering that is inside. And now you are missing heaven now. You are known everywhere, but you, don't, you are not known before God. So, and attacks will come now. Disease, problems. You hear me? Yes, sir. That's what Satan is doing on you now.
in Jesus' name. It's over.